this is your tournament match and this is a special tournament match introducing first he called himself the lunatic psycho Etienne Representing Vulture Gun from AOW. And his opponent. This is the Ginger Savage. Representing all hardcore feds or whatever. All feds, indie, indie, no rules feds. He is the Ginger Savage. Mike Danger. And the final contestant in this special tournament match. Representing New Extremes Wrestling, NEW, Simon Youngblood. Triple Threat Tournament Match. Let's get this match going. Oh shit, fuck. Bond jump, there we go. So what's up everybody? This is this is our final day of the tournament. And yes, you're not mistaken, this is a round two special tournament match. Because of request of Mike Danger, say he could beat both these bitch asses and still go to the finals. Boss man was like, You're right, Mike. You're right. You can beat both of them at the same time. How about a triple threat match? Well, actually, Mike requested the triple threat match. But Boss Man was like, let's make it spicy. Elimination style. No rules. No nothing. So this is our, um... Well, this is kind of weird for me. Because I never had this, this type of scenario happen from last from yesterday. So yeah, I'm like, uh... Bossman told me this is just gonna be a triple threat match. Tournament triple threat match, so yeah. <laughs> and both of them just double team on Mike Danger. Oh wow. Rules are simple. Elimination style, big fella. There are no disqualifications. No count outs. Bang, bang. Oh damn, bang bang. So yeah, this is yeah. Last man standing goes to goes to the finals. Oh my. Oh, what a headbutt by, by, by ETN. I got, like, just not realizing, I, they, they all got something in common. All three of them doesn't give a shit. They really don't give a damn. Simon Youngblood came from New Extremes Wrestling, so of course their show is, it has to be extreme. Mike Danger just a ginger savage. He's, he just doesn't give a fuck about human life in, in general. And then we get ETN. Comes with the lunatic psycho because he's cousin of Kano. So that's something. Gone. They all don't give a shit about each other. <laughs> like, look. Pinfall. One. Headband. Our, our referee headband is in, you know, refereeing the, the tournament matches. And, we have, and, and we're going to have Afro Refro, I hope, refereeing the finals. Because he's our, um, you know. He's our main referee. Damn, what an asshole. Just slap the shit out of him. Bang, bang. What the fuck? <laughs> hey, yo, they're fucking each other up, bruh. I'm sorry for my, you know, sailor language. I'm just like, wow. I'm in awe. They double team his ass outside the ring. Now they're going at it. He got a Kindle stick. This ain't hardcore, but... There are no rules in, in a freaking triple threat. Oh, damn. He, he missed a stick. Misses well, I, don't, I don't think they phased him. My danger is like, come on, let me hit somebody. There are pins and submissions, so yeah. No rope breaks. What's he going for? Suplex him outside the ring. And Mike Danger loves it. Oh, oh, bow, bow. Oh, disrespectful kick. Can Mike Danger beat them? Oh, he said, no, no, no. Mike Danger, like, he want to prove a point. He said he want both of them at the same time to, uh, to assert his dominance. But damn, man. 
I talked to Mike. He says they ain't shit. They just nothing but just people. And I hate people. <laughs> That's a Mike Danger thing to say. Snapmare. Go on top rope. But Mike Danger interfered. Oh, them both taunted. ETN getting getting a little frustrated because Mike Danger stealing his stuff, stealing his um, opportunities. Simon Youngblood over there just being Simon Youngblood. Oh, chop blocked by Simon Youngblood. And a senton. Oh, punch was punch, big fella. Who's gonna win this joint? And and ETN wins. Oh, 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 duked him up. Oh my god. What is he going for? Oh, he's, he's just in his tights. Fuck you doing? Yeah. Now he's doing something. Maybe his pants was about to fall down or some shit. Oh, he counted that. Going for it. Brain Buster. Oh, he stole his pants. <laughs> what an asshole. Cradle. One, two. Kicks out. Slap the taste out of him. Oh, ain't got kicked. To a Boston Crab. Eats him just standing. Well, he's walking around. Oh, he missed that. Oh, damn. Hit him square in his head. In his head. Hair Corona pin. Kicks out. Whoa, whoa. Hair Corona pin. And for some reason, Simon helped him out. Maybe, maybe both of them wants to eliminate Mike. Maybe they want to eliminate Mike because Mike was talking all that shit. Saying that he could be both of them. So I can see that happening. Uh-oh. Staring at each other down. Suplex him. Him outside the ring. And this goes a light tube. Look out, man. The light tube. Spline Buster. One. Two. Kicks out. Slap the shit out of him. He said, no, no, no. Throws him in the corner. Puts him in the corner and vicious headbutts. My danger behind you, man. Slapped <laughs> and brain buster. No, never mind. That's a suplex. Whoops. Oh, he puts his ass in the corner. Say, say, get your ass over there. Body backdrop. What's he going for? Moonsault. One, two, three. And my danger has been eliminated. Well, there goes my danger. A little shit talking. And we have the rematch from the from day one. Each him as a summon young blood. But this time, anything can happen. No count outs. So it's so gotta be a pin or submission. Oh, it hits him with a freaking light tube. I'm about to say lead pipe. What the fuck? I'm a try I'm about to say that, but I was like, damn it. Spine buster. Pinfall. One. Two. He kicked out. What's going for? Suplex. He got the Kindle stick. Simon, but watch out for that. What's he going for? Small. Well, it's they call it backflip, but I don't know why. And a sledgehammer. He said, "No, no, no, big fella." Ooh, what a kick! Oh, that pissed him off. Throws him into the guardrail. And throws him into the other guardrail. Throws him to that guardrail. Simon just punishing him. There's no rules outside, so anything could happen. Oh, he got Bob. He got Barbie. Oh, crack his knuckles. What's he gonna do now? Oh my God! Oh my God! On the bob wire! On the bob wire! Oh my God! Hit some butterfly DDT. And he got another one. What the fuck? Hey, where? Hey, who put these joints under the ring, bro? Oh my God! Back by drop on a Barbie. He got a chair. Well, that's well, that's understanding, but what? Oh, he gets in the ring. Oh, he misses. Punches his punch. They're going at it. They're going at it. They're going at it. They're going at it. He's feeling it. Oh, my God. What a kick. What? He gets up on right those Lariato. Oh, Simon's kind of hurt. Oh, oh, oh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Duped him up. Oh yeah, ETN only get up by um, I don't know, it's just adrenaline. 
Ooh, hits him with the Kindle stick on top of his noggin. Oh, what a Lariat, though. Now, now, now Etienne's punishing him. Come on, Simon. You got this, man. Oh, stop the shot. Damn, that. That man is like, what? He slapped me? Her on a pin. He kicked out. That's pure adrenaline right there. Back body drop. And both men are down. Never mind. Etienne's up. Oh, my God. Jesus Christopher. Oh, oh my god, what a kick. Ooh, slap him. Crack knucks. He's going for oh what a judo throw. To a super kick. Oh my god. And he going to the finals. Hey yo, that ending was okay. I gotta be honest with you. That ending, that was a good ending to a, to, to a fantastic battle right there. I got to get credit credits due. Oh, boy. Yeah, Nuke Shin Wrestling is going to the finals, man. That is tough. That is tough. Simon Youngblood going to the finals. But who he? But who is he going to face? We start off with a triple threat because we want to, you know, give y'all a little, um, because we need to get a good, get a conclusion to that. Horrible finish that I do not like. But yeah, Summer Youngblood going to the finals. He beat Etienne. Well, well, fuck, I just read something. He pinned Mike Danger over a moonsaw, beat Etienne with a super kick. Simon's a go. Well, time for our next match, you know. Yeah. This is going to be Eager Edwards versus Mike Baylor. I can't wait for that match. Let's, let's go on. This is your second tournament match. To go to the finals. Introducing first, he is known as the Memo, Eager Edwards. I like this. I, I, this song bumps, bruh. And his opponent, known as the Gunslinger himself, this is. Mike Baylor. This match gonna be fire, bro. Eager Edwards, Mike Baylor, 30 minutes time limit. Let's get this match going. I kind of argue, well, not argue, but I kind of have a debate about time limits in tournaments. Well, especially for this round. But. I don't know. Defending out, Eager playing chess with him. Eager with a snapmare. Snapmare again. Eager trying to get advantage. Oh, counter. Counter. Throws him in the corner. Oh, Eager all mad gets out the corner. Snapmare. Oh, missed that. Test of strength. Eager wins. And body slammed by, by Eager. Headbutt. I wonder what the what the, what them Japanese letter says on his tights, but that's just the point. Chip playing chess again. Oh, hit him with a punch. Working the arm. That's the kick. Working the arm again. He knows that Stormbreaker is going to be rough on him. Goes against the ropes, and he's going for it, and a kitchen sink. Charging up. Missed the kick. Put him down. Boston Crab. Playing chess again. They are, they're trying to, you know, like, I can see what they're doing. Like, they don't know each other. Even though they watch the tournament. But at the same time, they want to play it smart. I mean, Eager's all about figuring risk anyways, but... Oh, 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 with the chop. And Boss down stands him outside the ring. One. But, but what I was trying to say is that Eager doesn't really... Eager is just a... He just... He's a risk taker. Mike, I don't know... I don't know nothing about Mike. A lot about him. I don't know nothing. I don't, I don't know a lot about him. But from what I've seen, Mike, he just goes at it. 
he's he's not like like he's not afraid to put up a challenge or make you feel feel the pressure. Oh, kick with his chops. Oh, kick to the ribs. Pinfall. One. That's not enough. Body slam. Body slam. I wonder why he, Eager wears some goggles, bro. Like, this is probably off topic, but Eager got them goggles. But did he. Is this for decoration or something? Or for you to take flight? Oh, it's going for. Oh, the Koopa kick! But Mike automatically gets up! Yeah, put him in the back. Axe kick. That was random. Throws him against the ropes. He's going for it. And he misses it. Counter. Oh, he ducks it. Ooh. Mike getting a little frustrated because Eager knows his moves, apparently. Fiesman carry. Stomp to the stomach. And another one. Punch, kick, kick combination to a Boston Crab. Oh, and he works in, he working the leg with a camel clutch. The slow, methodical beginning of a match. I don't blame, I don't blame. They don't know each other. Always going for, oh, kick, kick, middle kicks. Eager gets up, grabs Mike, put him down, and go for the pin. Kick, fireman carry, stomp to the stomach, and a headbutt to the stomach. I don't know why that's even more effective. What's he going for? He's going, oh, he scouted Eager about to get up. What's he going for? And a lift. Chop. Another one. Eager gets up. Body slam. Picks him up. Snapmare. Stomp, stomp to the stomach. He's going for a suplex. Suplex. Drags him away from the ropes. In a vicious chop. Pinfall. One, two, kicks out. And suplex him outside the ring. I never seen Eager wrestle like this. This is so new. I'm trying to be technical. Hmm. Throws in the corner. Mike Baylor puts up, put him up top. What's he going for? What the hell? A burning hammer? <laughs> but Eager gets up from it. Oh, it's about to go technical style. Oh, he's trying to trying to be technical with a with a um young kid like 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 Mike. You know, Eager also kind of a young kid too because he's like around twenty or something. I don't know. Oh, working the arm. Oh, Connor. Oh, banana split pin. Punch to the gut. Oh, he's mocking Eager. Working the arms. He, Eager looks like he's in trouble, but no, never mind. He's good. He's good. He's going for a suplex. Oh, what a gourd buster. Fake out suplex to a, to a plant. Do it again? No. And Mike Bailey reverses it. Elevated Boston Crab. Was he going for a gore buster? Yes, it is. If that's a gore buster, like, 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 if it's not a gore buster, please correct me, please. But yeah. Oh, banana split pin. Kicks out. I think things better go fast and furious after the first few minutes of technical wizardry. He's going for the gore buster. I think that's supposed to be a setup move. Oh, he's going for Stormbreaker! Stormbreaker! From out of nowhere! Kicks out! Eager got a lot of heart. Brushing this sweet with a moonsault pin. Kicks out! Going for Gore Buster? No, he's going f and hits him with a suplex. Oh, he's going squat style. He's trying to make him tap out. Trying to make Eager tap out. No. Rush this sweet. 
showing allegiance, showing, showing his allegiance to, I don't know. But then, oh, uh oh, never mind. That was, that was, man, that was Russian last week. I was about to say, oh shit. The other against the rope. He's going for face buster, face crusher. You're kind of tired. Uh oh. You're going one on one. Mike feeling it. Insecurity. Pinfall. One, two. Kicks out. Oh, her can run a pin. Kicks out. S -s -s Catching. Yeah. Fake. Whatever. Ah, oh, can't say it. Damn it. Oh, face plant. One, two, three. Mike Baylor going to the finals. Okay. I'll be Hermes honest with you. I could, I sensed that Eager wasn't prepared for this match. I'm not saying I, I, I wanted Eager to win. I just wanted a good match. But, you know, sometimes shit happens. You know, you get, like, this, like, they, like they're still young. Like, these, like, these motherfuckers are still young. So, they haven't had this type of tournament ever. So, they probably burnt out or something. I don't know. Like, I understand that. Because you just wrestled yesterday, you wrestled hard as shit. Like, Mike went up against Curtis. Eager went up against motherfucking um, Russell Sutton. Good matches. I can see why they're kind of a little hurt. But hey, we got some exhibition matches for y'all to, for y'all to, you know, to feast your eyes on. These matches are just to give the other motherfuckers a break. But... That doesn't mean they won't be good. Let's just say these matches probably hinting something. I don't know. But yeah. Hope you enjoy the indie matches. I might commentate on them. Cause because I need drink because I need a swig of water. Hey, Miss Matter, can I Oh shit. Oh fuck we live? Oh fuck. Um, coming down to the ring, the main attraction, Nella. I'm sorry, y'all. I can't sing for shit. And her opponent. I actually looked up how to pronounce her name. So I think I, I'm going to give it a try, all right? She is, what well, damn, you want me to bite you? Shit, man. This is Kagomi Katsura. Nella was Kagan because her first encounter. That's tough. Match going. This is your exhibition match. You know, just to. You know, because they requested it. Like, this is a tournament show, so. Damn it, my fucking mic. Like, this is. Oh, God, power drive already. But, like, this is a tournament show, so they want to, you know, showcase women, too. They're like, why don't I just. Why don't we both fight each other? Like, we know each other, but we just want to, you know, go against each other. Boss man was like, okay, cool. Wrestling, wrestling, some wrestling here and there. Cross arm breaker. What's she going for? Th throws her to the corner. And she gets out. Oh, what a vicious chop. Oh, counter. Wrestling, 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 wrestling. Yes, sir. I'm sorry. I'm I'm a big fan of mat wrestling because it's just it's so freaking cool. So um, pinfall one out of one count, you know. Ooh, vicious elbows. Ooh, and another elbow for the trouble. Yo, know? she's going for half and half. Yo, they point out all the big moves from the from, from the get go. I ain't expecting this to happen. I guess they're like, I guess they want to show show off. Ooh, missed the shoulder tackle. Mr. Chop, throw her in the corner. She's going for drop kick onto her, into in between her boobs. I don't know. I just looked at it, okay. One, 
Kicks out. Travis a chop. And a diving elbow drop. What the fuck? And a <laughs> drop kick. Oh. Drop kick. Cag on me. Netbreaker. Drop kick. Pinfall. But but Kagami kicks out. Oh headlock. Now she gives a damn. What a chop! And oh my fucking god! She need to go for the pin after that. I don't know. I guess she want to do more damage. I mean, I don't blame you. Like fuck, man. Oh elbow. Tell her to come on, bring her ass here. Oh elbow her. And a drop kick. Oh, she was, oh, she was going fucking at it. Oh, counter! Kicks out. Oh, my God! Yo, that punch. One punch woman, my guy. She going for it, and an elbow drop. Picks her up, missed the kick. Counter. Backdrop. I thought that was gonna be a murder drop, but shit. Oh, she's stun stun. Tornado DDT. Go for the pin. One, two, kicks out. Oh, she's pissed. She's like, why the hell you kick out? Execution. Kicks out. Counter. Oh, get a clutch. But that's a freaking rope break. Oh, chop her, and she's down. Oh, she's showing her muscle muscles. She finally got some. She finally got rid of the green tape on her wrist. Thank you, cause that was cause they didn't match her outfit for shit. Oh my god, yo, her freaking rights. Yo, she just clocked her so hard. Cradle. I'm a mark. Oh, sorry guys, I'm a mark for cradles. Oh, uh oh. Half and half. Pinfall. One, two. Kicks out. What's she going for? Oh my god, that power ball. Oh, she got the fuck up. Oh shit. I need to fix my mic. God damn. Oh, she's gonna kill her. What's she going for now? Oh god. Oh my god, what a power ball. And she beat Nella. Hey, that was, hey, that was hard. I'm gonna tell you guys my little thoughts after this. I, let me give her a moment, okay? Okay, uh, finally, I can tell my thoughts. That was a hard, that was fucking, Jesus. <laughs> like, if y'all guys not a fan of superstars or whatever, they need to be in superstars, like, ASAP. Especially Kagome. Kagome is a freaking killer. She literally set the whole thing up. Like, she was like, I'm going to kill this bitch. And she hits it with a firebomb, my guy. Oh, my God. That was a sexy-ass powerbomb. What the fuck are you guys looking at me for? Just just because I said it was a sexy powerbomb doesn't mean anything. I'm just appreciating the move. God damn it. Fuck. Some judgmental bastards. This is your second exhibition or showcase match, whatever it's called. At this point, this is going to be interesting. Introducing the American's Reaper, because he'll reap your freaking souls out your body. Kai Howard. Yeah, man, take a bow, man. I haven't seen you ask for a while. And his opponent. He is the Grunge Boy. Claude. Kai Harvest Claude, three minute one fall. Cash the cash referee. Oh shit, I know. So here's some little um 
backstory, okay? If y'all know a person named Kai back in the IWR days or the, or the AZW days or, you know, whatever. He's here. This is K K Kai. He actually got a last name now. Howard. Kai Howard. A.K.A. that one motherfucking little guy that could beat your ass regardless your size. <laughs> so yeah, Kai Kai returned back to the Zero program, man. We got a lot of motherfuckers coming back. We got King Riki, Ricky Maru. We got motherfucking um, Claude. I haven't thought we were going to see this motherfucker in a while. But now we got Kai. Shit. And these motherfuckers are small. <laughs> so they're going to be excellent high flyers or cruiserweights or juniors or light heavyweights. Whatever, whatever you want to call them. Well, shit. He already want to make you tap out now. God damn it. <laughs> Latching your arms. Well, some things you gotta fix. Oh, oh, oh. Yes, Kai always wears a bow tie when he wrestles. If you got a problem with that, I don't care. That's just Kai's little thing. He's a gentleman. For those who don't understand his attire, he's he's like an American on. patriot that's a that is basically on. just don't give a fuck. Come on. Come oh my on. Well tell me, come on. Come on. He got out of that. And a body slam. Drags him away from the ropes. Stomp on his face. Damn, man. Toe kick. Caught him. Elbow to the back. But now he's being an asshole a little bit. Uh-oh. Working the arm. Out of nowhere. Missed the toe kick. Sidewalk slam. Kick him in his mouth. Ooh, toe kick. Oh my god, just drop kicks him out the ring. He said, get the fuck out this damn man. Damn. Arm drag, pinfall. But he kicks out. Punch him in his gut. Working his legs. Counter. Well, the five man carry, that wasn't a counter now. He just did it. One. Was going for back drop body body blah, blah, blah. back body drop damn. What was he going for? Oh, he stopping tracks. Oh 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 okay oh oh my god. Okay okay. <laughs> body slam him outside the ring. Oh, now he's taunting him. Captured Irish whip and going for a knee. He runs against the ropes. He's going for oh, give him a kitchen sink for his troubles. And working his legs. Sidewalk slam. Dragon leg school leg takedown on the ground. And jumping arm breaker. Working his legs. Stomp on his legs. Latch lock. Claw gets out of it. Gives him a suplex. Him outside the ring for his troubles. One, two, three. Oh, oh, oh! I had never seen that from Claude. I'm gonna pull all the stops. Stop on his face. Nagata lock. Wait, is it? Wait, is it the Nagata lock? Oh. Well, submission hole locked in. Jumping arm breaker. Drags him away from the ropes. Being an asshole by rubbing his forearm on, on his face. Hip toss. Key lock. The key lock. Her Karana pin. Kicks out. Drop kick him out the ring. Damn! You saw the way he landed? Yo, I thought he, I thought he got a, I he broke his neck landing, landing like that. Damn, man, Kai just don't give a fuck. Those on side the ring, he's like, fuck you, go. Well, I finish respect. Oh, now he got a piece of wood. He's, he's tired, of this dude. He's like, I'm tired of you, bro. Back body drop on the wood. Well, legs hit the wood, but okay. 
He's feeling it. Picks him up. Chop block. Pinfall. One, two. Kicks out. Clobbered him. Knee to leg to knee. Asshole and tendencies. Drives him away from the ropes, but his legs on the rope. Oh, come on. Oh, tell me, come on. Oh my God, press Frankensteiner. He gotta be done. He gotta be done, man. No, he kicks out. Oh, quick silver. Counter, back body drop. He's feeling it. He's going for, oh. Oh, what a, oh, what a submission hold by Claude. Even though, even though he's not submission specialist, he's more of a, I'm gonna beat your, I'm gonna beat your ass. Oh, oh, call him a dead man, man. Oh, drop kick. Drives him drive away from the ropes. Pins him. One, two, three. No, 2.9. Jumping arm breaker. Drives away from the ropes. Picks him up. Oh, counter. He's feeling it. Drop kick. Picture paper drop kick. And that took a lot out of Claude. Oh, what's it going for? What's it going for? Oh, shorter, shorter thrust. Damn, what a bright. Oh, kick him in his head. What an asshole. Submission locked in. He's going to tap out. No, sir. Triangle Lancer. Finally got the move name right. Throws against the ropes. He's going for something. Bulldog. Wait, not Bulldog. Face Crusher. Come on. Counter. Counter. Drop kick. He gets up. Hurricane on a pin. He, he had it head tight. He got it tight. He got it tight. Oh, he kicks. Oh, somehow he, somehow he gets out of that thing. Oh, my God. Oh, I need water. Chop him down. Drop kicks him. Oh, I think he, I think his head on the um asshole. <laughs> I just gotta say that because that was asshole right there. Back fist pin. Oh, he kicked out. Counter German suplex, but that's against the ropes. Counter back body drop. Going for submission locked in. He's on the ropes, man. I mean, miss. My bad. Oh, my God. A grunge. Grunge driver. And he beats Kai. In 2009. Hmm. I'm curious about the story. Right now. That was actually not. I, I, I fucked with that match, okay? Heavy. Fucks with that match good. That was a good match. Like if like if you like COD has a future. But I don't know in what. I've been hearing a lot about a returning juniors tournament or something. Like Sky High. But I don't know if he might be in Sky High. But like either way, man, like Claude Oh, he called the modified head drop brain buster. <laughs> Might as well call that concussion city. <laughs> but damn. Kai returned to the zero programming and um he lost. I mean you win some, you lose some. But at the same time, he showed that he, he has not missed a step. So I like this match. You know what time it is, right? You know what time is it, right? It's the finals. Mike Baylor versus Simon Youngblood. Simon Youngblood versus Mike Baylor. This should be good. <laughs>
Young blood. And his opponent. He is known as the Gunslinger. This is Mike Baylor. Hey, look, Afro Refro. The Afro, the, the Afro Refro. Yay. Six minute time limit. Summon Young Blood versus Mike Baylor. One fall. And here we go. Fight. Tournament finals, y'all. Are y'all guys excited? Whoever wins this match, they get to they have the contract to any title, any of the three main three men's title. I have to make I have to make correction because when I say all titles, they mean women. No, all titles that's, that's for men, such as the tag team, the gateway, and the NW championship. So this should be good, my guy. Whoever wins this match get the goal for any title they want. Oh counter, oh counter to him. Give him a punch. We saw Simon Youngblood lose round one by a count out, but Mike won it. But I mean, yeah. But the boss man was like, I don't like people winning by count outs in in my tournament. So let's do this a rematch. But Mike won a fucking make it a triple threat and his bitch has got eliminated first <laughs> oh well simon beat both of them pinned both of them and now we're here versus mike baylor who was currently kicking simon like a motherfucker he won two matches wait and, and like he beat i could pull up the history he beat he, no. He beat Curtis Keller and then he beat Eager Edwards. So he got his right to, to be in this joint. Simon Simon is a kind of controversial, but hey man, a win a win. I mean he don't have to go through, you know, two rounds. He just beat both of them. So that's some funny. Suplex attempt, but got reversed to a suplex attempt. Hmm. Let's see. Let's see who's going for suplex him in the middle of the ring. Simon. Sent on. In my honest opinion, this is this is gonna be the closest fight I've ever gonna see. Some people root some people in, in New Extreme Wrestling rooting for Simon. Some people from NAW or other indie shows root for Mike. It's a clash between two fans, two two fandoms, or two Oh, 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 oh! Duke his ass up. Counter. And he counted out to a Bulldog. 450 splash. I'm um, ref. He's kind of out the ring. Okay. Counter to another Bulldog. On top row, 450 splash. No, 054! Oh, his finishing maneuver. But he kicks out of it. Simon, looking kind of hurt. I mean, I don't blame him. He went through hell. He went through a triple threat match between two dangerous ass wrestlers. I don't blame his. I don't blame him. Fight Mike. Oh, going for it. Backflip. I was about to say, you going to do the springboard, my guy? Haha, <laughs> you funny guy. Get your ass in the ring. He's beating him senseless. Hell no, we ain't getting this goddamn count on victory again. There we go. I'm about to say, I ain't dealing with another count out. I should turn that crap off. But anyways, pinfall. One, two, kicks out. Mike Baylor is a fighter. Some some young blood is a brawler. Oh my God, hit some of the rainmaker. Ripcore Clariot though. Kicks out of that. Look, tosses him, lift him. Pinfall. One, two. Kicks out of that. Repeated kickouts. Sidewalk slam. Time to come on. Get a little breather in. I feel you, B. 
Goes him against the ropes. He's going for it. Superman. Super elbow. Punch. Punch. Super elbow. Okay. Super kick. Are he done with him? Yeah, he said, no, he's done with you yet, yeah, boy. Uh-oh. He's going for... Oh, I better go for his combination. I haven't finally realized that he got a combination somehow. Kicks out of that. Lifts him up. Throws him against the other corner. Is he going to go for the pin after that? Yes, he is. One, two, three. And Mike Baylor is the winner of the tournament. Simon, don't feel ashamed for yourself because you put up a goddamn fight in the, in the beginning, my guy. I mean, after all the fucking, um, tr after his triple threat match, I could tell Simon was fucking hurt. Because he got to face up against crazy ass lunatic Etienne and then the, then the Mr. I do not give a fuck about human race and human life in general. Motherfucking Mike Danger. Man, Simon, you pulled out a fucking fight. Don't feel like shaming yourself, man. But enough about Simon. This is about Mike Baylor. He won the tournament. That means he could that means he could go for any of the three belts we we let you go after, which is the Gateway Championship. Hell, he could get a tag team partner and, be, and go for the tag team titles. Or he could be ballsy and go for the freaking NAW championship. This motherfucker's a kid. And he's literally just beat four. Wait. Go round one. He beat. Fucking, um. Damn it. Uh, he beat Curtis Keller. Then he beat Igor Edwards. And then he beat Simon Youngblood. Versus Simon Youngblood, he lost to Etienne by a count out. And then he got put in a triple threat tournament match, a special tournament match between Etienne and Mike Danger. Beat both of them asses. And then he came just so oh so close to beat Mike Baylor. I had a feeling if he would have hit that super kick, the ground super kick, it would have been lights out. But Mike Baylor spotted that. Clever guy. But yeah. That was the tournament, y'all. Simon Youngblood, Mike Baylor. Mike Baylor, the victory. The, the, the victory. The victor. He go for any tie he wants. I'm curious to know what title he chooses. I mean, you don't... I mean, you could go for Gateway. You could go for Tag Team. You go for the main belt. Up to you. But remember... Once, once you make your, once you made your decision, that's final. So, so thank you guys for watching this special NAW tournament, the the new ambitious tournament, the two day tournament. I want to say thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for being there for me, and thank you guys for actually you know supporting me. So. Check out these wonderful feds. You don't have to if you want to, but it's your choice. Check out these wonderful federations that's not by me. But I, you know, want to associate with them. And yeah, man, like, just, just enjoy your day. Thank you guys for watching, and see you next time. Ciao.